Hi everybody, welcome back to my channel. So today I got another influencer box and mine's kind of beat up um, because my mail lady is crazy with my packages like I've told you before. But if you don't know what influencer is, it is for anybody. You don't have to have a YouTube channel, just any kind of social media presence. And you go on there and you do a whole bunch of activities. You answer questions, review products, you know, do little kind of little Twitter parties that they have and so on and so on. And the more active you are, the more likely you are to receive boxes of things to review, depending on what kind of badges you decided to grab. And I I get them from time to time. Um, I'm not as active as I used to be because I'm really busy on my channel and product reviewing. So I'm as active as I can be, and so I get boxes kind of far and few between now. So it's been a while since I've gotten a box, but I finally got one, and they sent me the Maybelline um, Better Skin kind of challenge box. And I was really hoping for the YSL box, but I know that I'm not really that active on there right now, so that's probably why I didn't get it. And I got this right after I had already bought the Better Skin Foundation myself. But the awesome thing about this is they actually sent it to me in the right shade. Because if you guys watched my haul, I bought it myself, but I had to get it a shade darker in um, Nude Beige 25 because my Target didn't have my shade. They sent me out my perfect shade, so I was so happy about it. I got number 20 Classic Ivory. The thing about these is they run kind of dark because I haven't been classic ivory in a long time. I used to always wear classic ivory and then I noticed when I started really getting into makeup and YouTube that it wasn't really my shade. And so I do think that they are a little bit dark. Um, the line, the foundation colors run a little bit darker than normal colors in any other kind of range. So that was something that I didn't like about this particular line, but I love Maybelline's foundations. I have heard a lot of negative reviews on this foundation, to be honest. Um, I was actually told the other day that I was the first person that one of my viewers had actually seen say something positive about this foundation. I really do like this foundation. Um, I It's just like any other kind of Maybelline foundation that I've ever used that I really, really like. And it goes on really nice. I think that has a, a great coverage. Um, it does have a light smell. You know, like you do smell it kind of like this chemical smell when you're putting it on your face, but it doesn't stay on your face. So I really do like that. It keeps my face dry and matte. Like I don't feel oily throughout the day. It doesn't break up on me. I really like it. I'm wearing it today and I've had no issues. Now I do use a beauty blender, a damp beauty blender when I put this on. That might make a difference. I'm not sure. I haven't used it any other way, but that's how I put my foundations on and I've had absolutely no problems. I've been using this for a couple of weeks now and I'm just noticing that my skin is just better and I can't really tell you like what kind of difference I'm seeing with it. It's just I'm not breaking out. I don't feel like my skin is having these weird blotches. The redness is the biggest issue that I've seen that is kind of just clearing itself up. And I don't know if it's this foundation because I'm using a new Acne Solution skincare, so that might be what's going on as well. But I do know that I like this foundation. I like how it works, how it applies. I like how it lasts throughout the day for me. Now, I do have oily skin, so that might contribute to why I like this. This might be more for oily skinned people. And I don't I don't really know like why so many people hate this and it's really bugging me because I like it. I really, really like it and so many people don't like it. This foundation is made with ACTYLC, which is like another way to get vitamin C into your skin. And vitamin C is so good for your skin, you guys. Now, I use a lot of vitamin C when, I, when it comes to my skincare, and it works so well for me. So it cuts back on my, like, oiliness. It gets rid of any kind of sun damage that you get. And I really think that that's what this is for, is it's supposed to help you, along with your skincare, to just clear up your skin or any kind of sun damage you got and just try to correct your skin as well as being a foundation. So I think that they might need to reformulate it if so many people don't like it, but I think the idea behind this foundation is amazing, and I hope that they continue to do things like this and just perfect it because, I mean, there's a couple of things that they could tweak on this foundation, but really, I would repurchase this in a heartbeat. I've used it every single day since I've gotten it, especially since I've gotten it in my right shade. And, I mean, you can see my skin. I hope you can see it, right, because of the lights, but... I have had no issues. I love this. It covers my freckles, and you guys know that that's what I care about. I like full coverage foundations because I like to cover my freckles. This covered my freckles, so I've had no issues. 
I really, really like this. I do hope they reformulate and kind of fix the smell on it, but I mean, maybe make the foundation colors a little bit normal like their other foundations. But I like this, you guys. I really, really do. So that is my review on the Maybelline Better Skin Foundation that I got from Influencer. Thank you so much, Influencer, for sending it out to me to review in my shade because I cannot find it anywhere else around me in my shade. <laughs> Leave me a comment down below and let me know if you guys don't like it or do like it and why. Because I am trying to find somebody who actually likes this along with me because I really like it and I just don't understand why people aren't liking this. I do know that the smell can get a little overpowering, but it doesn't last on my skin. So leave me a comment. Let me know your thoughts. And I will talk to you guys later. Bye.